folks. Just met this man. He's a big Dexter fan, so uh, what do you want to see from Comic-Con at Dexter? Yes, sir. I, well, I spotted this gentleman on the street with a badge saying, I love Dexter, and I just had to stop yeah. him. And <laughs> I, what I, I, when, when I got season one DVDs, I did not have Showtime at the time. I, I watched it in one day. Episode after episode, just could not stop. I think until four in the morning. But it started four in the afternoon, went to four in the morning. Cool. So I have get, I've turned three people on to Dexter. All of them have done the same thing. Once they watch one, because the way it's set up, it's a cliffhanger. Right. Setting you up the next, one, the next one. Next yeah. one. Yeah. Everybody, nobody will quit. They will all <laughs> go an entire season, or if they do just be quit out of sheer exhaustion, they'll put it on first thing in the morning. So I asked this gent, uh, what's going to happen in season eight? I've read the, the previews in the, I believe, TV guide, and that cliffhanger with Deb at the end of the last season and Dexter, and then just what little I read, it's going to be a fascinating yeah, end I, to Dexter. I agree. I agree. However they end it, it's going to be great, but I am, again, going to wait till... I don't watch it on Showtime because I don't want to ruin it. I'm waiting till the DVDs come out, order them on Amazon, and then back to back to back, spend a day watching season eight of Dexter, and I'm looking forward to it. And so... At Comic Con here, we're going to, have to try to have an answer to this question. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate Thank it. You, I'm, sir. Just, I'm an extra fan, and that's all there is to be said. Yeah. Hey, thanks a lot. Thank you. Cool. Cool.